ஹலோ எப்படி வாங்க வெல்கம் யூ ஆல் டு மை ஐ செக்ஷா பிளாகர் டுடே ஐ எம் கோயிங் டு ஷோ ஆன் அபவுட் வெரி இன்ட்ரெஸ்டிங் டாபிக் மோஸ்ட் ஆஃப் எம் ஐ கெட்டிங் கோரியா ஆன் திஸ் ஸ்டெப்ஸ் டு கிரியேட் ஏ விடோஸ் இமேஜ் யூசிங் த விட்ரோ மேனேஜர் ஆன் யூ கிளிப்டஸ் ஸோ அவர் அல்டிமேட் கோல் இஸ் டு கிரியேட் ஏ விண்டோஸ் இன்ஸ்டன்ஸ் இன் யூ கிளிப்டஸ் ஓகே லெட் சி திஸ் இஸ் மை பிளாகர் யூ கேன் சி மோர் ஆன் ஸ்டெப் பை ஸ்டெப் கோயில் ஓகே சி பிஸிலி பை திஸ் டுடோரியல் சி ஒன்ஸ் த இன்ஸ்டாலேஷன் ஆஃப் யுவர் எக்லப்டிஸ் இஸ் ஓவர் யூ நியூ இயர் விச்சுவல் மிஷின்ஸ் லைக் ஓபன் டு சென் டூ இயர்ஸ் அண்ட் விண்டோஸ் மிஷின்ஸ் பட் பேசிக்கலி பை டிஃபால்ட் இன் யூர் இக்லப்டஸ் செட்டப்ஸ் ஒன்லி லினக்ஸ் இமேஜ் ஒன்லி இஸ் அவைலபிள் ஓகே ஸோ If you want to create a Windows or Ubuntu or things, so lab lab things, the way, the, this is the way to create a Windows engine, okay? So, if the people feel difficulty to what I am talking about, the decor of this installation and all, just click this, um, click this link, it will be redacted to some pages, and you, I, I have described as early on the previous blog, which is what is in Ciclopters, how to install this, this blah blah things, you can learn it from there, okay? Okay, now we begin to start with Windows image, how to create this Windows image in Ciclopters. Before proceeding with that, you need this pre-request is on your phone things, ensure these things. First things, you need this driver. If you want this driver, this is the reason for basically we need to support your Windows face, okay? Uh, you, you click this link and redirect and you can download it from here, this link, okay? And one more thing is you need Windows image preparation tool. It's also you see important. You can click this and you can download it by here. At last, you need, yeah, uh, you need a ISO image of Windows. That is mean you, you need your, your Windows image. Like what can I say, if you want to, think it simple, if you want to uh, reconfigure your system, that means you, you see whenever you, you, your system getting fit, what you do, simply uh, get your windows image in CD and copy it into windows image into a CD and getting into reconfigure of your system. Like so the same way you need the windows ISO file here. So three things you ensure that first one is your windows driver. and then windows image preparation tool at last the windows iso image okay once there is three softwares should be uh, before that you need to create a one new folder under your send to s root directory okay create any folder any name okay whatever you like and copy this three things one is your iso image of windows and your driver and your preparation tool that's why it's pre request is have more than enough okay So, as I said before, now we are going to create a Windows image using Vitro Manager. If you want this Vitro Manager, this is one type of tool, this is software, okay. If you need to set up this Vitro Manager, as my previous blog I explained here, just click here and you can run it here, okay. See, this is the things. This is the steps you can follow, okay. No need, you can refer here, okay, later. Now we start with proceed, okay. Now I am going to show you how to create that Windows image. Ready? See, from your CentOS instance, on the top corner you can see that with Visual Machine Manager, you just open it. Okay. And then you name it as your, you have your software. See, here in my case Windows 2008 or 2 standard. And you must be need to specify your name as same as here okay so i'm doing here it should be same as your windows image iso image and then choose your iso image that is where you browse it in my default as i said before be under an root directory right See in the root directory, I have three files, drivers and ISO files and preparation. So now I can browse this ISO file. 
yeah i done this process you can see here then you, you choose what's voice type it's a windows type right so windows version it may be server okay it depends on what you need so ram you better see in my case is available was 3503 ram out of that i can give 2 gp of ram that's fine to end off if in if you need good performance you need to improve so this is your hard, hard disk basically uh, 275 is available out of that uh, windows requirement 20 gp it's fine so everything fine so click uh, check this customized configuration before install and then choose a width time should be kvm no issues all fine so i think it would be nat yes it should be a default nat all going well okay next finish it okay yeah start it now okay yes so now your instance is ready this instance windows instance is ready now your goal is to converting that iso i i iso image of windows instance to i i dot img extension this is only eclipse support so now I need to change this disk bus as Vitrio. Okay, ensure this all things and apply. Before that, yes, apply. Okay. Take few seconds. Yeah, the device model also should be in Vitrio. Okay, two things should be Vitrio. Okay and click apply and then begin install shot top right corner okay now your instance getting ready to boot wait for seconds it's same as what simple you configure your windows installation on your machine same as going here hold on few minutes see your windows was starting up so nothing but it's in booting your windows machines it is is a basic basic thing of your installation of windows it's very slow because if your memory was good the performance also good okay because my guy given 2 gp only no so it takes very slow to loading booting okay but no issues all will working fine see how much slow this oops I hope people you know will I skip this I skip the steps. Still need more than steps too. See now you are windows is opening. See at the background back side your performance of CPUs. So you need to provide in language as English, what you like. This is a basic instruction. I hope you know well about this. Just click install now to proceed. So Windows Server 2008. So setup is starting.
okay you you can choose your what types of architecture i choose on windows server 2008 either uh, standard enterprise so leave it as a standard and next accept the license and next Yeah, I want to change this data center for guys um, after that you choose you choose accept see here in the case your driver was missing don't get get panic just you need to load the driver as i said initially we download the driver so just load the driver for doing this you can see the upper key of the blue color no Here basically your driver was missing so not in so we have initially downloaded it right so just load the driver that's fine itself if you want to do this just click this blue blue at the top with the blue at the high symbol just click that and you get into that uh, oops, that IDE CD room here here first thing is you need to disconnect this and then again need to connect it so that we can able to load your driver right so need to connect now it's asking this proper window load your necessary files what file we need to load here we need the driver file so get back to your root folder under which module created so under the root directory I create a win folder first window under that I can browse the Went to win uh, set driver so I just open it load a successfully then click ok so now again I am going to get back to my original image now I can check with load driver and I can see load driver will be available here ok So this is another case. Now see, we can see your driver. Right, and uncheck this. Okay. So you need to check, uncheck everything. So select all. Click this check box to ensure once you've done this again get back to IDE because we need to boot your Windows machine. So get disconnect again need to connect. 